So number three, an electronics store reduced the price of a TV from 1200 to 1104. What was the price, what was the percent of the decrease? Okay. So 1200, so the, the, the price of the TV went from 1200 to 1104. So we have got to subtract, don't we? $96 decrease, just use your calculator there. And we get a $96 decrease. The price dropped by $96. But they didn't ask how many dollars the price decreased. They said, what's the percent of the decrease? So how do we, how do we figure out the percent of the decrease? Do you have to divide by um, 1,200? Yeah, exactly. Good job, right? You've got to take that $96 and divide by the $1,200, right? Because that's what we mean when we say the price dropped $96, it decreased $96. We're saying what part of $1,200 is that, right? Because that was the original price. You've got to divide by the original. You've got to take the decrease over the original and I'm getting 0.08, which you know, that's 8%, right? If we change it back to a percentage because the decimal needs to move two places, that's our answer, 8%. That's an 8% decrease. So yeah, exactly, good job. So when they ask for percent of decrease, they're saying 96 is what part of the original price? What part of the original price went down? 96 is what part of 1200? 96 divided by 1200, 0.08, and then change to a percentage by moving the decimal two places, 8%. So what percent decrease? 8% decrease. That's an 8% decrease on that price.